Hello, good afternoon. I'm Steven. I'm from Korea. So today our topic is the real meaning of Christmas, and today is 15th of December. Yeah, Christmas is 10 days left, right? Yes. Yeah. So we can count that day by using our finger, like one, two, three, four, five. What is the next? Maybe I can count only for five, but it doesn't matter. So before I start, do you know the definition of Christmas? According to its knowledge, the word Christmas comes from the Latin word Christus and Massa. So I think we know what is Christus. Can you catch the point? <coughs> okay. I add more exact meaning of each your curious mind. The simple means Christ. By the way, what is the mass? What is the mass? In English, that is mass. Do you think I'm talking about the quantity of matter? Of course not. <laughs> Well, so much for my factual thought. <laughs> People with various personality and nationalities celebrate Christmas in different ways, and I believe it because of one big reason, that is cultural differences. Today we are going to talk about three countries and how different they are in celebrating Christmas. According to my Filipino teacher, the Philippine has Mass. They attend dumb masses, and that is also known as Massa di Gallio from December 16th to 24th. Yeah, that is 9 day, and tomorrow will you will be attend? Yes. Uh, yeah. <laughs> if we can complete that, our wishes will come true. On the flip side, each family's deal is to gather food and eat together. And they and then pray and offer thanksgiving to the Lord December 5th, early morning. And I think needless to say, family reunion is the most important part of Christmas in the Philippines. No wonder why they call this season season of love, right? Yes. You're called this season, yes, December. Season love. Yeah. In Korea, Christmas is common for couples. So they usually go on a date in a romantic restaurant. As far as I, in addition, as far as I know, Christmas is just an ordinary gathering between family and friend and partner <coughs> to show our respect and to love each other. You know what? In Taiwan, they don't celebrate as Western people do. They just meet and eat together on Christmas with their precious people to show they are well or good. And they just do some activity like exchanging gifts. Based on three different ideas mentioned above, we can conclude that they do have the same related point about Christmas celebration. And I think it is love. In my, in my own point of view, in Christmas we share our love in many ways with our loved ones. So the true essence of Christmas is to spread your love through sharing your happiness, not only to yourself, but also to other people. Spread your love, spread your love with your important people. And I want to say something with you. Merry, please say, Christmas. <laughs> Thank you.